For the first time since the 2009-2010 yeah. season, we have no Aaron Rodgers and no Tom Brady in the divisional round of the playoffs. Which one of them needs to call it quits? I think you can make the argument for both. I, sure. I think with Aaron Rodgers, there it seemed to be a, 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 a he was at peace in the his end of the season press conference uh, after their season was over. But I look at Tom Brady, and I say you have uh, seven rings, you have all the records when it comes to passing, uh, you have three hundred million dollars waiting for you when you decide to hang it up. You are the undisputed GOAT uh, when it comes to the National Football League in terms of quarterbacks and also winning. There's nothing else for you to prove. So if I had to pick, while I think Aaron Rodgers might be the one to call it quits first, I think Tom Brady is the one that should hang it up. This is why Tom Brady needs to hang it up simply for me is I don't think any of us want to watch him decline. Like we have seen him play at such a high level and I think we really got a taste of that uh, in last night's game. I, I don't think I could watch a full season of that because I'll always have the memory of what Tom Brady was at his best. It's number one. Yeah. Number two, a player of Tom Brady's caliber across any sport. And I, I feel like even with LeBron, as much as I love him, one of the things that I will sit back and criticize about him, Tom Brady was a New England Patriot. That's how we should remember him. But now he's a New England Patriot and a Tampa Bay Buccaneer. And there could be a third team on top of that. Yeah. And for a player of his caliber, it's going to be really hard for me to say Tom Brady, the Patriot, the Buccaneer, and the whatever the heck else he's going to be. So that's part of it for me. You don't want to be Willie Mays on the New York Mets. My father watched Willie Mays his entire career, and he still to this day says the saddest thing he's ever seen in baseball was Willie Mays on the Mets because he wasn't the same player that people remembered his entire career. And this was a guy who uh, is arguably the best player to ever lace him up in Major League Baseball. So, you know, sometimes it's calling it quits is the right move.